Hi, my name is Sam and today I'm going to go over how to use the color wash module on Avizo. The color wash module allows you to overlay two scalar images on top of each other. So to start out, we first need to open some data. So we're going to click open data. We're going to go down to tutorials and we're going to go to, and we're going to open chocolate bar and chocolate bar labels and click open. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to change the ortho slice to be on chocolatebar.am and I'm gonna create a color wash module. So I'm gonna right click on ortho slice and search for color wash, like so. And there we go. And then in the data module, or the, in the data port, I'm gonna select chocolate bar labels.am. So one thing to note is the reason why these colors in the color wash are different than the colors that when we attach an ortho slice to this, or the colors in the color map here is because the color wash module uses the material colors stored in the label field parameters if a label field has them. And if it doesn't, then it will use the color map. But since chocolate bar dash labels.am has colored stores in the label field parameter, it doesn't use this color map, but it uses those colors instead. If you want to learn more about how to do this, I suggest you check out my video on the create label color map module in Aviso. All right, so the next thing I want to go over is this transparency slider. So if you move the transparency slider to one, the color wash goes to be completely transparent. But if you move it to zero, it's completely opaque. So this allows you to easily change the blending amount of the original image versus the color wash. You can also change how the two images are combined by changing the fusion method right here. And there are a bunch of different options. All right. That's all for today. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope you have a great rest of your day.